Hear ye, hear ye. Today's challenge, five things you need to know about ordered lists. Yesterday, we learned that lists, like headings, have specific HTML tags that allow assistive technology, like screen reading software, to make sense of the items in the list and convey the list's information to students. We also learned that the feature in the Canvas Rich Content Editor that creates lists will magically transform your list into a beautiful bulleted list. But there are other kinds of lists. Today, we want to introduce you to an important sibling to the unordered list. Meet the ordered list. Hello, ordered list. Here are five things you need to know about ordered lists, also known as numbered or sequence lists. Number one. An ordered list has similar HTML to an unordered list, only the beginning tag is OL instead of UL. That one tiny change in the HTML makes a world of change in the page you see, though. Number two, use numbered lists when the information you are using is a specific sequence, like instructions that go in a specific order, or steps in a process. Number three, use numbered lists to convey a set of items when the number is finite or when the number is significant to understanding the list. Like when I tell my spouse I need three things from the grocery store. Number four, use the same process to make a numbered list that you used to make a bulleted list. Type in the list items, each on a separate line. Highlight the items in the list, then select the number list format on the top line of the RCE or Place your cursor where you want your list to start, select numbered list, and add your items. At the end of your list, hit return twice to continue with paragraph format, or hit return and then deselect the numbered list format. And five, you can do an initial check of your list formatting just by taking a quick look. A properly formatted numbered list looks like this, with nice tidy numbers and indented text. Not like this, where the text is not indented, and definitely not like this, where the numbers are followed by a parenthesis. Wow, you made it to the halfway point of the 10-day accessibility challenge. Nice job. Here's a little bonus reward for you. We've talked about classic styles of unordered and ordered lists that begin with a dot or a number, but Canvas has more default styles you can use. Since you know I love lists, I mean, what's not to love? Let's take a quick peek. The Enhanced RCE has six, yes, I said six, default styles to choose from, three unordered and three ordered styles. So dig in and make some beautiful lists. And that's it for week one. Learning together and sharing with our colleagues is the key to our success. See you on Monday for day six of the 10-day accessibility challenge.